request for the evening, which is 2016-13, City of Valentine. As we, as we talked about in our work session, these are text amendments to Chapter 310 of the LDR. It has to do with stormwater utility. Um, there's a three pages of amendments. The main point of it is to uh, put into place in the LDR something that City Council has already decided to do. Um, in their adopted budget for this fiscal year, they've raised the base rate multiplier from $2.50 to $3.50. Um, so the proposal really is to put that into revision of language of the LDR. Um, so that is amendment number one. In your packet, um, what I handed out this evening is a slightly revised version of that where we changed um, paragraph E to simplify the language. In other words, we are omitting the language of what this rate was in 2006 when the stormwater utility was adopted. That's 10 years ago, that's sort of old history. And we really want to have in here the language that this will change automatically as City Council adopts and approves the budgets which is when all of the other fee schedules and fee rates are determined. This happened to be in here in the LDR. The rest of it under amendment number two is housekeeping stuff. Uh, a couple years ago, the stormwater staff or the stormwater division moved from the utilities department to the engineering department. Um, and we had never updated the LDR to reflect that. So while we're in this part of chapter 310, we're taking the opportunity to make that fix. Uh, so that's what all of the changes under amendment number two deal with. Um, also, for your information, as we attached in the packet, is the stormwater utility information brochure, which explains in a lot more detail how this multiplier, uh, multiplier right that rate, I can't talk my mouth um, how this rate is used for the different types of properties. It's not a flat rate, but it is used simply as a ratio. With that, I'll be glad to try and answer any more questions you might have on this other than what we talked about at the work session. Just for clarification, Matt, I believe the city just raised their village rate and the county just raised theirs, and now you want to approve another increase or something. Well, this is a rate that's already been increased. It's part of the budget that we're in. It's just not reflected in the LDR. So in some ways, it's a housekeeping item, but we also want to change the language so this happens as part of other fees. Um, but yes, I mean, this rate is a lot lower um, than it is in other municipalities, a lot lower than it could be. It's a revenue source for the stormwater division. Um, some of the rationale behind increasing the rate was we have some capital projects coming along that need some revenue um, and a few things that we're not anticipating. Um, so it helps us do some things a little sooner rather than later. Um, and it's a you know, dollar a month difference for the basic rate. Um, smaller homes, it's 50 cents because they don't use the full AP, something smaller, like this is explained in the brochure. Just, just, just. And to keep in mind, this is a rate that was adopted 10 years ago and it hasn't changed since. So it's not something that changes very often anyway. Which rate? 250 was adopted in 2006 and it's been that way for the past 10 years. That was adopted in June by the city council, part of the budget. And now we're having a public hearing. So now they didn't adopt so that, but now we've got public hearing to say it's okay. <laughs> well, they had public hearings back then, a whole series of them. <laughs> and that's normally when they adjust utility rates and a bunch of other things that are not normally in the language of the LDR. So we're sort of playing catch up on making a change here. <laughs> was, was the amendment twos and, 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 and the changing from the director of utilities to city engineers, was that all public hearings? And, uh, well, that's what this part has done. That was all part of the restructuring and process that the city does, moving staff and divisions around. Um, it's not a special vote that's required to do that. It's an administrative thing. Um, it's just the language in here did not reflect that. It's sort of outdated. Um, we you know, don't go into Chapter 310 very often, and this is its own article, which is sort of buried in the back of the chapter. Um, it's the first time I think we've ever amended this part of 310 in all the years we've had the LDR. Yeah. 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 Ye
Well, did they not know it was in there, or they just... I think it was forgotten about it, but uh, candid about it. We just had overlooked it. And then when we were looking at the rate, and we knew that it changed, I think, and of course it had been 10 years, I think some of the stormwater staff said, you know, I think that's in the LDR. We may not, might want to look at that. So we found it, realized it needs to change, and while we were looking, we saw some other things that needed to be updated. All right, thank you, sir. I don't think we have any more questions up here. You can totally trust that. Uh, I don't think there's nobody here that's going to speak for this, so we'll <laughs> bypass that. It's <laughs> going here if anyone wants to speak. Anybody here wants to speak in favor of this request, please come aboard. If nobody here is speaking in favor, anybody here wish to speak against this request? You can't speak against I've been told I can't speak, so. <laughs> so, that being said, commissioners. <laughs> Do I have a motion on this request for Mr. Martin? I would vote it down to see how they would handle it. <laughs> I recommend approval of the text amendment to the LDR. We have a motion for approval. Do we have a second? That seems pretty hard to get. We got a second, Mr. Gladwin. <laughs> All in favor of raising a dollar on rate of your storm water, please signify by raising your right hand. No, that's not, that's not the motion. <laughs> the motion for approval, Ms. Carmella, of the LDR, of the LDR text amendment. Please seek the power raising your right hand. I've had a hurt to do this. Mr. Gregg, are you opposed? I'm opposed against it. Okay, it's 4-1 on that, Ms. Carmella. Really? Yes, it is. 4-1. 4-1. It's been a long evening for some of the director getting the fight up here. All right, guys, y'all did an awesome job.